This is the CBS Radio Workshop. Blues is a woman And a woman is the blue Sometimes she paints like a pair of tight shoes Cause blues is a woman and a woman is the blues. Sad news and glad news, but mostly bad news. One ain't enough, and two is too many. Life is rough stuff if you ain't got any. Love is a hunger that few of us can fill. True love's as rare as a three-dollar bill. Love is a heartache that you take and you chew. Sometimes you win, boy, and sometimes you lose. Cause blues is a woman and a woman CBS Radio, a division of the Columbia Broadcasting System and its 217 affiliated stations present the CBS Radio Workshop, radio's distinguished series dedicated to man's imagination, the theater of the mind. Cause blues is a woman And a woman is the blues Tonight, transcribed, an original story ballad, The Legend of Jimmy Blue Eyes, by Edmund Brophy, with original music by Ray Noble, starring William Conrad as the narrator and Jimmy Dodd as Jimmy Blue Eyes, horn by Manny Klein. In Storyville, where blues were born, there's a legend of a golden horn. And a hot-lipped kid, blue-eyed and fair, who tried for a note that wasn't there. So come along Perdido Street with our hot licks tickle dancing feet that shuffle in patent leather shoes, where Jimmy Blue Eyes blew the blues. Now Jimmy Blue Eyes came on earth a child of hunger from his birth. He played all day around the streets of sin. And they spiked his milk with old Tom Jim. He second lined each funeral band, rushed the can when they made a stand. He held their horns with love and care while his face lit up like a county fair. He followed the tailgate players round when the wagons rolled through back of town. And the only prayers he ever knew were the kind of blue note trumpet blew. Uh, he roamed the streets from sun to moon, his bare feet beat to each tonky tune as it crept through the gin mill's swinging doors and the sawdust danced on the white tile floors. He stole free lunch from barrel house places and hustled a buck at the fairgrounds races. He talked to dice like a lover can. And he aimed for the life of a sporting man. When Jimmy Blue Eyes turned 16, he joined out Jill, a blues song queen. Jill dressed him like a special prize, this Dixie kid with her soft blue eyes. I eat 20 suits and a Stetson skimmer, a box back coat and a diamond glimmer, a gold chain draped his fancy vest. Ah, oh, he went first class. He was the best. Now, Jimmy Blue Eyes loved to dally at a card room down along Big Alley. 
He could riffle a deck with gambler's ease and clean a cotch game like a breeze. One night, a player met his raise with a silver horn from better days. Oh, I guess that's it, boys. I don't see no more money on the table. I'm folding up. Hold on, Jimmy Blue Eyes. I got me some grouch bag dough. Deal out one hand a stud. One hand and I quit, win or lose. No, no good, Chippy. You blowed plenty of horn on the riverboat for that. I don't want no grouch bag money. Who says you're gonna win me? Deal the cards. King, Trey. King bets. 20. Queen, six. King, queen bets. 20. 10, eight. King's high. 20 again. Jack, deuce. Possible straight bets. 20 more. I'll raise you 20. I'm 20 shy. I'll put up my horn. Oh, that's a pretty beat up piece, man. She blows plenty sweet. Got a tone like a silver bell. It's a go. What do you got? King high. You? Deuces. <laughs> Jim showed his win to his loving Jill in her fancy flat in the morning still. Why, Jimmy, honey, you couldn't call home the cows at sundown with that old thing. Why, she's a singing dream, baby. I'll call the children home like Buddy Bolden used to do. <laughs> I tried her out walking up Rampart Street. You could hear the echo down the riverside. But you never blew horn before. I was top horn in a reform school band. Well, that don't make for playing Tom Anderson's saloon. And you're not filling in alongside King Oliver in a funeral band. That's a cinch. Sweet Jill, I'm sure no fancy Dan. But I'm a dead bang natural music man. I'll take this battered silver horn and make it talk come Mardi Gras morn. Jimmy, my love, since I was born, I've loved the music of a horn. You learn to make it weep and shout. I'll love you till the stars burn out. Well, me and the blues are kid and candy. Or St. Louis and Memphis and Mr. Handy. If you stuck a pin in my heart, it's true. A drop of my blood would come out pure blue. But summers came and winters went, and Jimmy's loving heart was bent as for he hit that master blow. His sweet Jill blew with Hot Lips Joe. Now, Hot Lips Joe, he had no peer. He could shave the head from a glass of beer with a wind from his educated horn, just as sure as you were born, just as sure as you were born. <laughs> The kiss-off gave poor Jim a jolt. He loaded up his blue steel coat and headed for the circus house to croak at double cross and loss. Hot Lips Joe was holding the floor when a cold spit lead type 44. The bullet sang around his head. Jim killed a tourist guy instead. In sheer disgust, a gun he slammed upon the floor, and then he lammed along the streets of jazz mad night while whistles blew to halt his flight. And back at Minnie's circus house, Hot Lips Joe, that heart thief lost, cased a sucker on the floor and smiled and whispered, Never more. He did? Put a mirror to his mouth, Hot Lips. Don't need no looking glass. Man got no pulse. He's a goner, dead as a mackerel. 
Jimmy Blue Eyes gonna get himself fitted for a hemp necktie. And the execute man gonna bag his pretty head with a little old black bag. Mm, it's curtains for Jimmy, boy. I say amen to that. Amen. <laughs> No, never more will Jimmy Blue Eyes catch me with a lead surprise. This hog wild kid is through for fair, a cinch to dance upon the air. Before he ever got a mile, poor Jim was nailed and brought to trial. The old judge burned him with a look and up and hit him with a book. In a cell where Jimmy locked, steel secured, and granite blocked. He played a music rich apart, a gift God gives a contrite heart. <laughs> summers came, long winters went, and all of Jimmy's time was spent to reach a chord, to cut the air and blow that note that wasn't there. The sun went down in Storyville when love went out with Jim and Jill. First war came in Prohibition, and a district went to quick perdition. The diehards died on bathtub gin. But the music lived like hidden sin to tickle toes in northern lands with the advent of the Dixie bands. But New Orleans was much alive in the year of 1935. Jim took the long road home at last. The dark and bitter days were past. Now when Jimmy Blue Eyes hit the bricks, he was master of hot licks. His trumpet clawed and tore the air in search of a note that wasn't there. He played the hottest spots in town, nearly blew the ceilings down. When his encores all were done, they said, Oh, that man is Gabriel's son. <laughs> the throw money fell at Jimmy's feet in full blown gale, the silver sleet. He smiled and played right on until his mind ran back to his heartbeat, Jill. Now you show me an artist, fine or fair, who seeks a note that isn't there, and I'll show you a guy that most men ain't. He's alone in the clouds, an uncrowned saint. For he scatters joy to his fellow man, though he might wind up and also ran to drive past glory. Fortune, fame, it's Nirvana, sure, but a heartbreak game. And Jimmy's heart and soul sent out the soft, sweet tones of his trumpet shout. He blew it hot and low and high. He hit the fringe of heaven's sky. The multiplying strains made naught. He couldn't reach a peak he sought. He blew until the notes were vain, elastic stretches of his brain. Uh, he tried horn and mambo pills, but they wouldn't bring a trumpet trills. He killed a quarter rye each day, and it didn't help for his high note play. Jimmy, boy, your, your case is tragic. You'd best resort to mammy magic. She cooks a pot like jungle stew. There's conjure in her devil's brew. Where's this mammy magic live? Where? Tell me where. Two miles north of nowhere. One mile south of someplace. <laughs> Look over your shoulder, man. The old hut in the wood? The old hut in the wood. Now, Mammy Magic was her name. A voodoo witch of power and fame whose spells were famous as the blues from New Orleans to Newport News. Monsieur Jimmy Blue Eyes, entrez. You know me, Mammy Magic? You know my name? Few things are secret to one who has a third eye. You are troubled. Speak. 
Some walls and windows have ears. I read your thoughts. Well? Your desire is beyond my power. You lie, witch. I got the price, woman of darkness. I'm desperate. Do you hear me? Desperate. Level with me. I tell you, Jimmy, on the level, you got to see my boss, the devil. You're asking one thing I can't do, despite the magic I can brew. I'll have no truck with devils. I'm selling. You are here to buy. What's he asking for price? I don't make out his bills. He keeps them plenty private. Get your devil man. We'll cut up a deal, me and him. So Mammy Magic cast a spell to summon up the king of hell. Dambala. Dambala. came in a flame of smoke and thunder that almost tore the town asunder. He smelled like absinthe and smoke and mud. His eyes were rubies, pigeon blood. He stood erect in a manner bold, and his tail was 80 carat gold. Your very humble servant, sir. Yeah, I... I Speak I, up, I, sir. There is no occasion for fear. I pride myself on an understanding heart. Well, uh, here's the situation, mister. Just call me Red. I'm a very democratic chap. All souls being equal before my eyes. What is your problem, Jimmy Blue Eyes? And what is your heart's desire? O okay, Mr. Red. Here's the setup. I want to blow the... The Red King made a deal with him, had a secret locked inside of Jim. And then with the evil lot of old Red turned that silver horn to gold, Jimmy Blue Eyes walked on feet which never touched upon the street. He wore a broad smile upon his face, for that never, never note was his. That long, elusive note was there, the most immortal anywhere. But when he blew it, come what may, he had an awful price to pay. Old Hot Lips Joe had just come down from a long run in Chicago town. He'd been the world's top trumpet king for 20 years, come one more spring. The jazz folk down in New Orleans dug folding money from their jeans to bet on Jim or Hot Lips Joe to contest for the master blow. <laughs> Put your money where your mouth is. I got a century, says Jimmy takes it. Well, you get it up, man. It's like shooting fish in a rain barrel. Kansas City bets on Joe. And Memphis takes your bet. Chicago goes for hot lips. That boy can really blow up a stone. His money, marbles, chalk, and beans on Jimmy. The pride of New Orleans. <laughs> Who'll cover five G's with cash, not talk? It's Jimmy Blue Eyes for old New York. Most ever perish up and down bet scads on Jimmy's horn renown. The high and low of fortune's birth came on from ever end of earth. The joint was jammed, and the 88 was under the dukes of a solid gate. The SRO sign hung outside, and there was Hot Lips Joe and his beauty bride, Sweet Jill, the nightingale's song. A dead wrong broad, dead wrong, dead wrong. Playing a puff at a ringside table, sipping a amber, draped in sable. And Joe took a stage with a master's pride and cut his trumpet open wide. He blew hot notes heard round about. He turned that trumpet inside out. He 
blew till all the glass was broken. He blew so hot the joint was smoking. His horn turned inside out and curled. The last note traveled round the world. When Joe sat on, the cheering sounds bust tombstones in the burial grounds. His look told Jim with unfeigned joy. Go peddle your papers, little boy. Get a hand caught, Jim. You can use that horn to peddle fish. You ain't got a prayer, Blue Eyes. It's like stacking a cellar door dance up against Bill Robbins. Jim took the stage and struck a stance bold for a guy with a Chinaman's chance. <laughs> He warmed the hot notes, let them fry to a whisper tone, like strong men cry. They felt his lonely, bitter years as the horn wept soft metallic tears. Then quick mad laughter with a jeer, go cry in your beer, go cry in your beer. And now, switchblade gashes and razor slashes blend with whiskey bottle crashes, culminating in a wail from the foul, deep bowel of a tall wall jail. <laughs> He ran the scale of man's emotions like changing tides upon the ocean. A harsh note cursed. Another prayed, have mercy, brother, I'm sore afraid. His horn sang smooth and educated and blue and true and dedicated. The music of that Dixie man was greater than the pipes of Pan. The high, soft sigh of a trumpet's cry can tell what magic words can't try. For the horn sings true as it only can, unmatched by nature, bird, or man. Man sings his heart with tongue or pen. Words give and live through time again, but his very heart and soul ring clear when a true horn speaks for all to hear. And the crowd sat frozen round the gaff. Jim split the ceiling right in half. He blew the walls down and the doors. He raised the carpets off the floors. From a land of cotton, this disinherited, misbegotten son of a slum and sin and gin blew that scatter outside in. And yet, he seemed like a tired life going home from a weary earth and a heartbreak roam to that promised land of a fairer climb out there on the other side of time. Taylor for Jill, sweet. Blow it high, and you might love it till I die. Jimmy Blue Eyes hit some bars that blew out half a million stars. And then that never, never note went clear ten jillion miles to heaven's ear. And when it faded, died and broke, that blue-eyed kid went up in smoke.
Now, some rounders claim they're in the know that Jimmy Blue Eyes fries below. But in New Orleans, they'll lay your odds. He's playing trumpet with the gods. For a deacon man was there who preached that before the last note cut and reached the edges of eternity and died. Father, forgive me, his trumpet cried. No matter where or when hot music blows, if you're not hip, ask Dad, he knows. Jim's golden horn, the love of faithless Jill, when blues and we were young in Storyville. Now Jimmy Blue Eyes came on earth a child of hunger from his birth. They spiked his milk with old-time gin. And he played all day around the streets of sin. So come along Perdido Street where the hot licks tickle dancing feet that shuffle in patent leather shoes. But Jimmy Blue Eyes blew the blues. In Storyville where jazz was born, there's a legend of the golden horn and a hot-lipped kid, blue-eyed and fair, who hit that note It wasn't there. Tonight, transcribed from Hollywood, the CBS Radio Workshop has presented The Legend of Jimmy Blue Eyes, an original story ballad by Edmund Brophy, with original music by Ray Noble, and starring William Conrad as narrator, with trumpet by Mandy Klein, adapted and directed by Sam Pierce. Jimmy Dodd, in the part of Jimmy Blue Eyes, appeared by arrangement with Walt Disney, producer of the full-length motion picture in Technicolor, Song of the South, starring Uncle Remus and the Critters. Song of the South will be released nationally Easter week. Also featured in the cast were Roy Glenn, Georgia Ellis, Sam Edwards, Lou Merrill, Nan Boardman, Jack Moyles, and Tony Barrett. Featured in the all-star band were Tom Peterson on trombone, Matty Matlock on clarinet, Sammy Weiss drums, Nat Farber piano, and Larry Breen bass. The workshop is produced in Hollywood by William Frew. Blue. 